Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Brianna, and I'm going to be reacting to episode 4 of Mary and George, The Wolf and the Lamb. I'm still not over episode 3. The Somerset did a fantastic job. I believe it's Laurie Davidson and Pearl Chanda. Someone correct me if I'm wrong. They were fantastic in their parts. But I'm still looking forward to the rest, so let's watch episode 4. The Wolf and the Lamb, Mary and George. Uh, creepy, the music. <laughs> hey, they what? Say. They did say if we ever tell a soul of like this, we're dead men. Grave diggers? So that implies that George. Not George, excuse me. The king. Oh! Jesus! Toxic relationships wherever that kid goes. Georgie was doomed from the start. I know he gets like a hot head later or something. I mean, he sort of has one now a little bit. But, man. You bit me. Let me see. In his sleep? Like he doesn't know? <gasps> oh, better. No, he was like so needy before, and now that he has George there, it's like, oh, John. I feel so bad for John. Should someone be with him? Can he swim? John. Uh, 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 John. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Come on. Not again. Yes, again. Does he not know he can't swim? You can talk to him, you know. Why don't you ask him? I'm really beginning to miss being bored. Huh? And alone! Yeah, he was tricked. John is so sad. He misses you. I miss him too. Mm. Is the king not mm. keeping you busy? It was like a hunting terrier. Me? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. oh. Well, look at all those other mice, though. Who else has been trying to feed it? Oh! So sad. He would never leave me. Would he? Ah. <laughs> wow. You'll go now, son. His mood changes every hour, every second. Jeez, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <gasps> we can always count on Sir Francis. <laughs> All this loyalty talk scares me. When you go up north, don't take your eyes off him for a fucking second. God, the hat, the hair. Could someone, if you see this video, explain to me in the comment section, and I'm sorry if I missed it, about the pearl earring in the left ear of most of the men on the show, correct? You had that stuff on the horses. I didn't realize how, like, scared horses can get sometimes until I saw, like, this random video on Twitter or X or whatever a couple years ago. There was a piece of paper on the side of the road and the horse was freaking out and wouldn't pass. I was like, oh my gosh. It's too early to say. I won't know until I've seen every episode, but so far, this is my favorite episode for set location authorize a marriage contract for his daughter. We tried that, and it didn't work. Lady Hatton would feed my knees and joints to her dogs. She used my skull as a brandy glass. <laughs> he is George's now, no doubt. Join our family. The stage is yours. My wife to pay you for my rise. Yes. I love that part. Christ. Lucifer. 
That is my what? vase. No. Give me my vase. No. Be strong. How? Follow me. What the fuck? <gasps> Got the contract for Francis. Thought you could turn up. Wave it around whilst I was away, do a spry jig and merrily steal off with her. It's not... Clark Page is an ale-riddled, flatulent blabbermouth. That's why I changed uh -huh. my plans for Italy. Fuck. Really will get Francis. Oh. She was like, oh. <laughs> that does suck, though. Mm. Oh, my God. I love it. Oh my. This show is crazy. But we're done. What is there to fear? Can you not just fucking trust me on this? I know where we tread. You're better off here with us wee bairns. Didn't ask you, pal. I'm not a lord, I'm just wee master kit. Innocence? Protecting. Mm. I don't need protecting. We all do love. Yeah, you do. Somerset was something car. He was Scottish, and you do seem incredibly Scottish yourself. No offense. And yes, Somerset, my my cousin. Well, my dear Gosh, Lord James feels very well. Even if he keeps you on such a long distance leash. I collared him in the pig pen, and he was a chatty catty. Francis is in the main mm. house. Mm, clever girl. Where's Lady Hatton? It's her cousin's house. It's like she knows that she's too deep in it now where it's like, well, might as well. Didn't know what she was getting into when she and Mary were like a thing at the beginning. No, did they take her? What? Oh. Jeez. Your dirty animals broke my arm. Bones here. Reputations do not. I know, Father. Dancing? Yeah! You were drunk, you were sad, hmm. and you drink. I will keep my guard entirely, you know, up. If he finds out, he knows what his young pups do. Does he? Fucking I, he must. the grave uh, thank you oh yeah right for fuck's sake how long has he been waiting how are the lords I saw you with your darling little soldier boy I know his family do you can we're actually to Actually, about how much he admires you. Which is it? Nothing or admiration. Your lies reek almost as much as you do. A man worthy of me as a vessel of God. Why don't you go and find a bed elsewhere? Hmm? You're good at that, no? very sordid. She is ours. It is plain fact. Clear in law and custom. No. Heavily disputed in both. Not by... But perhaps I could be like another king. Solomon. So we slice a baby in half? In a manner? Yes. We wait for the king's word. Until then, you have two mothers to look after you. Well... Back to the provinces, you plod. Mother, we 
we must live together by law. Perhaps we could be a little less cruel. These people killed my father before I was born. Gave my mother to the English to be caged and beheaded. The fuck are you looking at? This guy. He really does change moods every hour. What is it? I went back to the house as you told me, and it was hell. Tears and screams and more. He sliced her. <gasps> First dinner he was allowed out. He just grabbed a knife off a plate she carried and just put her eye back in. No, don't be dark. Oh. Dowry will help. You still want him wet? What does this change? What doesn't it? I didn't see that. No, she's shaken up. It's never been this bad before, huh? Nothing ever ends. She's delusional. John's lucky to still be alive, yeah? Like, normally, I don't know what, how people took care of each other back then who needed help in this way, but he would be dead right now, right? If it weren't for position, her sons with the king, I, oh my god. It's good to be by your side about the distractions of the city. Distractions? Hen. James, are you all right? <gasps> there are horses. Our horses, they were here, they were right here. Oh, we tied them further. What's going on? Treason. Trapped by water, no means. What the fuck? And this. What the fuck? Traitor. You, the soldier? No, yes. No, no, you, the brother. Yes, you. James! What's he doing? I don't know. You could cover him with <coughs> Get him out. Get him out. Give him space. Let him crave your return. Let's you and me get away together. Kit can come too if he wants. Huh? Or would he advise against it? I fear he doesn't like me very much. I assume they didn't just put him to bed. Like, there's a doctor there, right? Doctor's working overtime this episode. He maimed a servant, did he? You did very well. As ever. <gasps> you sure we weren't followed? No, we are entirely alone, love. Come on. This is a crazy episode. Lord Lennox. James was besotted. But other lords here were not happy with this Lord Lennox. Who kidnapped the king, brought him here as prisoner. Kidnapped. Over how long? Ten months. No, no. No, no. Okay, he needs speaking. to find out the. He needs to find out all the deeds though later. Lord Raven and family executed. The name Raven erased from history. Oh wait a minute. Fuck. I thought you could brag about what you did to my cousin to my face. <gasps> Fuck. It was. You were talking to you, we English slut. <laughs> Me. He was talking to me. <coughs> okay, Kit. Thought you were good for nothing. I'm the one who fucked up. Whoever you fucked, I pushed you away and into his arms. I was like you once. Whilst I was detained in that awful tower, he was exiled. He was your first great love. Every Scot thought he was using me. Was he? He loved me. I have proof. He gave me his heart. His actual heart. After he died in Albany, he... 
He left instructions for it to be embalmed and sent to me. Yeah, it's fucked up shit. I had it buried above Edinburgh in a quiet secret spot. But I decided recently to bring him home. The real purpose of this whole sorry trip. Am I a lovesick fool? <sighs> I think the king always cared for George, and with George, he sincerely did love the king in return, but it was confusing because you know, that wasn't his purpose for trying to get the king's attention and then he got to know him and then there are aspects of the king's behavior that were frustrating, his decisions with the way he ruled and it just, uh, like right now I feel the relationship is sincerely, you know, they both know, they care for each other. What does it say? Semper mea. Always mine. Maybe it is love, but I don't want to say that for some reason. I feel insincere saying, oh, they love each other. That doesn't, it doesn't feel right. I mean, no wonder the king doesn't know who to trust and all that shit. There, now leave it alone. Don't ever dig it up again. Ooh, the sleeve. I think I saw that on him earlier, but looks nice. I should bow to you, really. And yet you don't. Mm. How's your job faring? Fine, I think. Why? Did you want to make sure it was your version James heard first? Am I quite so transparent? Mm -hmm. Not just you. Sir Francis, it's so good to see you. I hope you've had a pleasant <laughs> journey. You've missed hours of conversation. <laughs> I love this show. Have you met young Kit Francis? He's a hero now. I've made him the Earl of Anglesey. Suits him, I think. He's a noble soul, this one. <laughs> Fucking A. Fucking A. Oh, for fuck's sake. Poor girl. Still, look what it means to John. I look after you, don't I? All of you. <laughs> that was a cool ending. <laughs> that was a cool ending. I was waiting for the moment when Bacon would have that first moment of, wait, what? I'm not in control? I can be surprised? What? This was an incredible episode. Oh, you feel sorry for everybody. It's like before I'm like, everyone's a villain. And now I'm like, oh my gosh, I feel sorry for every single character. It's just so awesome. I, if you're following any of my reactions to Mary and to George, there might be a pause or a break between now and reaction to the next episode because I have some stuff to do. Also, the idea of you premieres this coming weekend. I'm excited. I'm ready. I'm ready to see some dancing. I'm ready to hear some singing. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Hee. <laughs> That's my reaction to episode four. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. I will try and put a full commentary on my Patreon account. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you would like to subscribe, please subscribe. I hope you have a wonderful day, night, morning, evening, sleep time, rest time, worky time, rehearsal time, any time. I'm happy, I'm happy that was such a good episode. <laughs> okay, it was my favorite, yay. Have a wonderful, wonderful, Whatever you're doing next time, thanks for stopping by this channel. Bye.